is up to me. Are you ready to go? I'm not Hello and welcome back to Abed Onion. I apologise for the last episode having a lot of fucking around trying to get Serana to do stuff. Apparently, she only- SHUT UP! She only does this if you have no followers, so I had to dismiss everyone, and since I couldn't dismiss Dune and Marvin because they'd vanished, the I had to use console to commands. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to Of course. Uh, what yeah. is it? What I've you been do asking if you myself find your the same mother. thing since we came back to the castle. She was so sure of what we did to my father. I couldn't help but go along with her. I never thought of the cost. She did it for your sake. Possibly. I guess even a vampire mother is still a mother. She worried about me. About all of us. But she wanted to get me as far away from my father as possible before he really went over the edge. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I just didn't expect anyone to care how I felt about her. Thank you. Yay. Are we ready then? Yes. Put your fucking All blood right. in the thing. Here goes. A soul can. Let's save. Dun 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 dun. Oh. Um. You all right? That looked painful. Yes, it did. Now that I think about it, I should have expected that. Sorry. What is it? It's hard to describe. The soul can is, well, hungry. For lack of a better word. I've got a lot of healing it's trying potions. To take your life essence as payment. Couldn't it just drink healing potions? That'd be life essence. There might be, but I don't think you're going to like it. <laughs> Vampires aren't counted among the living. I could probably go through there without a problem. Not your first choice, I'd guess? No. Maybe. We could just pay the toll another way. It wants a soul, so we give it a soul. Yours. Oh, I... My mother taught me a trick or two. I could partially soul trap you and offer that gem to the ideal masters. How do you partially tra you trap someone's soul? Them. It would make you a bit weaker when we travel through the soul cairn, but we might be able to fix that once we're inside. Maybe. There's no I'm just... sorry. I wish I knew a better way, something that would be easier for you. Just know that whatever path you choose, I won't think any less of you. Sometimes... I know that better than any. Okay, yeah, well, can we... Okay, partially... Soul Trap, I don't want to become a vampire. Are you sure? Yeah. You'll remain mortal, but you'll find yourself weakened within the Soul Cave. Yeah, let's go. I know this is difficult. I'd never do anything that could hurt you. Uh, we'll accept this. Trust you completely, you. even let's though you're a backstabbing vampire. I promise to make this as painless as possible. Hold still. Bleh. Bleh? It's not very fun. Whee! At the soul can. The smell here. Let's try to handle this quickly. It's dark as fuck out here. What's the time? Let's wait an hour. My head should start working as a light source. Think a vampire would be right at home in this place. Could be wrong. Let's just find my mother and get out of here. I wouldn't have thought a vampire would be right at home in here, mainly because there's no one to suck. Hello. Is there no end to this nightmare? Nope. Bleep boop. Hello. Stay away from the Oblivion Gate, I told them. Did they listen? Of course not. Dun 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 dun. There's an ant. Where can I go and talk to him? What is this? This is cool. Hello. The clouds. The sky. It's all wrong. Everything's wrong. I can put my travel lantern. You'd think a vampire would be right at home in this place. No, but there's no way she would have left it in Tamriel. She wanted to get it as far away from my father as possible. 
I can't imagine a better place. Um, and if she then doesn't, find out where she hid it, if she's still alive. Well, as alive. I, I know she what was you mean. Or as now, or <laughs> probably to avoid whatever my father would do to her if he could get his hands on her. Or maybe her plan was to come back, but she was stuck here. We won't know until we find her. Yep. These things are a bit creepy. I assume they're dead souls. Hello. I no longer hunger, grow weary, or feel anything but loneliness. Who's there? Oh. There's, of course, got to be things that can kill us. Hello, Bone Man. How are you? How strong are you? You're as strong as nothing. That's quite, quite nice, actually. We might use Dawnbreaker on you then. Hello. The born man. He is gone. What am I doing here? Like you this. must help me find my artifact. He doesn't deserve to be in a place like this. Okay. I'm being attacked. I'm sorry. Who's Arvac? Sorry, I've got to go. Arvac! Arvac! Damn you! please come back! Sorry I had to skip that dialogue, but um as you can tell. I was being attacked. Oh dear. It had basically no mana. Hmm. It all. No more bone men? No? Good. Don't like those guys. Kinda do, but don't. What a horrible place. I mean, they're weak, but I don't like them. Doesn't mean I have to like everything. <gasps> Arvac! Come back here, you fucking horse! Arvac! What? Uh. He's. Okay, fine. Well, look what we have here. Someone with flesh on their bones. Oh, what are you talking about, man? Let's just say I sold something to a guy who turned out to work for a whole coven of necromancers. Yeah. How in the name of Zenithar was I to know the ingredients were phony? Do I look like someone that would double cross a necromancer? You do now. You got it. Horse, wagon, and all. Plopped here without so much as a word. What? Why are there wagons? I used to be oh, one of the best traders in High Rock, you know. People would track me down just to see what I had for sale. Yeah, well. Very funny. You might have done. You got your bloody wagon. What exactly are you going to pay me with? Take a look around. Gold doesn't exactly win you any friends around. I'll give you my vampire friend. I'll tell you what. I appreciate what you're trying to do, so I'll play along. The only thing I see around here in abundance are soul husks. Uh, you know, those ugly fungus-looking things growing out of the ground. Yeah. I don't, but I'm going to say yeah. 25 of them, and you can rummage through what was left on my cart. Okay. Odds and ends I've gathered over the years. Tell me what you're looking for, and maybe we can make a deal. If you have the husks. Okay. So, fungus, we're collecting mushrooms for a dude, because then we can look through his tat. <sighs> Skyrim. No! Plop. Oh, game had a lag spike, that's never good. That's really never good, that, I almost thought the game was going to crash then. This is very atmospheric, I like it. I wonder if I jump in one of these. Do I die? Nope. I'm not sure what they are. <laughs> Hello! Hello? Have I got to wait for Serana? 
trying to get your ass here. Mother? Oh. Mother? It can't be. Serana? Is it really Serana? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to stop him. To make everything right. Like your sword. Can I have it? You brought a stranger Or dagger. Here. Whatever. Have you lost your mind? Hello. No, you, don't... you. Come forward. I would speak with you. I'm closer than her. So how has it come to pass that a vampire hunter is in the company of my daughter? It pains me to think you'd travel with Serana under the guise of her protector in an effort to hunt me down. Um, I'd, I'd quite like an Elder Coming Scroll. From one who murders vampires as a trade, I find it hard to believe your intention. How did you know, know what I was? Come Serana on, I'm, I'm not wearing anything. anything to prevent Harkon from completing well, the that prophecy. Would show it I then, would have expected but... her to explain that to you. You think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? Yes. The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. Why? When I fled Castle Volcar, I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. So, it's quite good at shooting arrows at dragons like myself, in the eye to make them not see. Devout followers I could just kill Molig it. Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. So, hang on, wouldn't that mean that it would be anyone? Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana, and why I've kept the other Any Elder daughter Scroll of Cold as Harbor. far from her as possible. If Harkon obtained Ariel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon, the tyranny of the sun would be complete. Hang on, but why do you care in anyway? Eyes, it means you can go outside in the sort of day. The good of all vampires. Oh, well, I guess you don't want and how exactly to die. Do you plan on that, stopping that, him. that would do it, you know. Uh, I'll kill Arkin. If you believe that, then you're a bigger fool than I originally suspected. Look, I've got a giant mechanized I death robot, I a mad professor, plans. and a girl who likes to talk about things. All the fucking time. You care nothing for Serana or our flight. And Whether Serana. or not you've become one of us in order to survive the Soul Cairn, you're still a vampire hunter at heart. You're here because we're abominations in your mind. No. Evil creatures that need to be destroyed. Nope. Serana? The stranger aligns herself with those that would hunt you down and slay you like an animal. Yet I should entrust you to her. This stranger has done more for me in the brief time I've known her than you've done in centuries. How dare you? I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father. Yes, he's a fanatic. He's changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? If you'd only open your eyes. The moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy, that he needs your blood, you'll be in terrible danger. Terrible danger! Oh no! Away from everything I cared about. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you two. I want us to be a family again, but I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe we don't deserve that kind of happiness. Maybe it isn't for us, but we have to stop him before he goes too far. Too far! To do that, we need the Elder Scroll. Elder Scroll! I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. 
I didn't see. You've I've got allowed my eyes. hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. Thank you. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. Right. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. Yeah, you can, can, yes. can we get the Elder Scroll I've then? It's safely secured here ever since I was in prison. Yeah, I'd sort of noticed that. you're in a position to breach the barrier that surrounds these ruins. What do we need, we need to do? To locate the tallest of the rocky spires that surround these ruins. Okay. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled here. Right. Destroy the keepers that are tending them, and it should bring the barrier down. Yay, smashing stuff. I'm quite good at that. Well, return One more then. Word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Durnavir roaming the cave. Durnavir. Be wary of him. The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. Okay. Be careful. So. And keep my daughter safe. So hang on, let me let me if ask you a couple of scroll, questions. The barrier needs to come down. As you've been traveling in the soul cairn, your body has become attuned to it. Let's just say a tiny part of you rubbed off on it, and in its place, a bit of the soul cairn filled the void. Right. You should find no difficulty using the portal any longer. Okay. Be careful. Don't need to and ask those questions my in my opinion. Safe. I don't need to. Anyway, thank you for watching, and in the next episode, we shall attempt to destroy, I assume it's that tower, a tower over there, or just three towers? I don't know, some towers that appear to be below the sea. So, yeah, current location. Local map, that's the bugger. No? Fine, we just gotta use the. Oh, yes. One over there, one over there, and one over there. Okay. So, until then, <gasps> goodbye! Yes. We shall.